Hey, obviously that didn't happen. Nothing ever does. It is a romantic comedy, and like all romantic comedies, something happens to keep true love separate. In this instance, the day dawns on the wedding of my daughter, Felicity Jones, and suddenly her love from days gone by appears at the door, Luke Treadaway, and throws a monkey wrench into the proceedings. Where is the bride? I do so want to see the dress. You know, Dolly. She likes to take her time. She didn't take her time about marrying Owen Bigham. Short engagements make for long marriages. Just look at Nancy and David. Yes, just look at us. It's very much a comedy of manners in that this Felicity's family is all gathering in the house for the day for this wedding, and there's a ripple effect that affects all the people in the family. Maybe one of us should take her something to eat. No, Joseph, she doesn't want anything to eat. Her stomach is upset. Is she all right? It's nerves. Hmm? Nerves! It was that kind of bonding that comes only from doing a low-budget movie that everyone really loves. Since there's no separate dressing rooms and there's no trailers, we're, we're all stuck together entertaining each other all day long as we shoot. And um, in this case, it, it happened to be really fun. All the actors really loved each other. Just think about it. I don't have to think about it. Marry a man who can barely hold his knife like a gentleman... <laughs> Oh, you exaggerate. You're American. You don't understand these things. Have you mentioned this to Granny? Did she laugh? Why would she? It was her idea. I think that there'll be laughter and there'll be tears. Oh, no. We've got Shirley MacLaine, who comes as my mother, and that was absolutely wonderful. I don't think that will disappoint people. And it's just uh, more drama. You won't try to deny it. You must challenge the end tale now, sure. Can't we at least wait until we know they're dead before we discuss it? Don't talk as if I'm not brokenhearted, because I am. 